This is the most degenerate thing I have ever seen in my life. Oh, that sucks. You're in spawn, you dense jackass. What is wrong with you? He just, look, he goes right past him. Does he even see him? He doesn't even see him. What? What just happened on my screen? Let me introduce you to Team Schmungus, the second team of streamer degenerates behind Team Overwatch to enter into OWCS, featuring ML7, Boger, SK, among others, and their venture to not only competing in OWCS, but also qualifying for OWCS through one of the strangest matches that I've ever reviewed. I was asked to review this match. Kind of wish I hadn't. It was one of the most bizarre collections of catastrophic, cataclysmic cacophony of communication that I've ever heard in any professional Overwatch game ever. I would say that you might learn something from this, but that's factually not true. Stay tuned for a future collaboration with Boger, looking at their most recent match versus the most recent London Spitfire team, now branded SSG. I'm sorry for this, guys. <sighs> Should watch the final Schmungus game? I mean, maybe. Okay, so... <laughs> this is going to be juicy. Okay, so let's talk about the matchup here. I don't know Team Red's players. Mick G somehow sounds familiar. Chimera sounds familiar as well. Uh, I don't, I'm not as familiar with Zergi, although the name looks familiar, or Quirksu either. But obviously, SK Boger ML7, you guys know who this is. Obviously, the rank in the bottom left is correct as well. We Everybody knows exactly what's going on there. Wait a second. Wait a second. There. Yeah. Zergi uses a trackball. Oh, that's who. Oh, yeah. Team Fit. Mixi was like the. Yeah, I remember. I remember. I remember. Yes. Okay. I, I knew that name sounded familiar. Okay. So let's 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 do this, y'all. Let's do this. Uh, Moira Lusu, Cassidy May, Malga. Uh, basically, the way this composition works is that you can kind of like death ball it a little bit, and then when you death ball. You create a lot of space for your cast to be able to take a little bit of an offing and poke out. Now, the one problem is that the cast is not going to really get a lot of support on the offing. Like, you can take offings with this comp. It's just a little bit harder to when you're running Moira. Uh, this is a weird comp. I'm not going to lie. If I had seen this composition, I would have predicted a Kiriko backline instead to help with the Malga and to help with the offings. Because I don't, if we're going to run like the, the Moira here, I probably would prefer like a Reaper, like more of a Death Volley comp. But yeah, it's, it's interesting. Now, this playing on the enemy comp is way more off angly. This is a very anti Malga comp. This is basically, we're going to support our off angles with the Kiriko Lucio. We're going to let our Arissa just live versus the Malga because she's pretty good at doing that. And then Sojourn Ecker, oh, we're just going to vomit damage onto the Malga. The question is, is how good are these DPS going to feel versus Cassidy that's able to get up close and personal? So this will be interesting. Quirksu on the angle, angle maxing. They've managed to stuff them out of the choke because of the threat of the Maywall, really. Um, so far, a good initial positioning there. Boger needs to be cautious with how much damage he's taking. Does Zergi use the wall to rotate? Yeah, Zergi uses the wall to rotate. So this is actually pretty good here. Like, even in this quote-unquote brawlier composition, do you notice that through the threat of the Maywall and the Moira and so on, they've kind of choked them out like now it's like, how do you, if, if like, how do you clear out this angle here? You have to walk under the May. Well, then you get shot in the back. These guys can run on top of your back line. Okay. So what do we do? We ignore the May. We run into the back line here. No, because the May is going to be shooting your back line and, and doing so with impunity. So like, even in a short range composition like this, like if, if this is, you know, an NA team, you know what would have happened. It went three, two, one, roll, group up and roll down, but they're angle maxing even here. And this is where, this is where people die. This is where Cassidy's and May's get picks is because of this awkward stuffing the choke out and, and holding the rotation. This is a really, this is a nice setup here. Now, the real problem is here. And this is where Schmungus' comp is really, really bad. Because their comp is like, you have the poke from the Cassidy and the poke from the May, which is okay, but your support lineup is really, really, really bad. And your tank lineup is, okay, it's not bad, but you're going to be bleeding a lot of damage here. So probably what needs to happen here is something like Boger rotates to underneath or rotates to cover or ML7 rotates underneath uh, and, and they find a way to like leverage the Lucio May on the flank while Cassidy holds and pokes high ground. Or you could kind of group up and rotate as five here. That's probably gonna be the easier solution there. But you need to close the distance here with your backlines because the poke angle here is gonna be a bit of a problem. 
Bogor should probably take a lot of damage. Yeah, so this is, they're trying to control angle maxing here. Lusu's there, SK's on the angle. I mean, there's still angle maxing here. It's just not super well done. And, and, and there you go, there you go. I'm kind of surprised to see Sapphire responding this way. I think this is a misplay. What's this team's called? What's the red team called? Does anyone know? Because I don't love the response here. I, I think if you pocket your, loot, your your Sojourn here and have your Kiriko playing a little bit more proactively, I don't think, like, maybe Kruxu is just cracked. Because I think a pocketed Sojourn here should be a little bit scarier than a solo cast, frankly. Good boys. Yeah, maybe, maybe just cracked. But yeah, this is a bit of a, this is more of a punishing the enemy errors than I think anything good done by Shmungus, frankly. Bingus. But I mean, yeah, I mean, it was, a, it was a fine setup. You know, it definitely forced the error, right? Angle maxing. <laughs> oh, no. A a okay, a angling is just taking superior off angles to, like, do more damage and deny cover, right? Maxing is boger thing that he says all, all the time. The guy max maxes. You get what I'm saying? Sleep maxes. You know. Now I'm curious to see how Team Red breaks this trick. This is really poorly timed from, from Team Red here, sadly. Gotcha, I guess. Yeah, yeah, you and me both, mate. Um, okay. Obviously, major issue here from Team Red is that Arisa's just kind of 3 2 one out the flank. Team Red is not angle maxing right now. In fact, I think Alvocate's going for an angle, but Alvocate's not even ready yet, and they're already going through. So Ah, uh, yeah, this is, this is, this is not, this is not, <laughs> this is not good. And so Arisa should die. Arisa almost dies, and they decide to 3 two, one commit with the Coalescence. I like this play call. Yeah, and that combo is great. Huge combo. Slam into Cole. Yeah, that was not well played. Okay, and then they're going to keep going. They're going to keep going. I think they scout. Maybe they scout the echo split. No, no, no. They hide the cat. What is going on? What is going on? I didn't even see this. Guys, they don't even have a Susu for this guy. What are they doing? Bro, the Lucio goes right past him. What? He just, look, he goes right past him. Does he even see him? He doesn't even see him. He doesn't even see him, guys. <laughs> what? Dude, there's no way, man. There's no way. I think probably why they, there's not, they're not, they didn't see it here is the top left window. I think they're looking, he's looking top left because he's looking up, like up, up there. And Cassidy's right there. Yeah, just hold perfectly still. Bro, he actually, he bumps into him. What the heck? Oh my gosh. That is actually unreal. So yeah. Now you're going to notice as well that Boger commits with it. This is really important, this composition. If you guys have been watching any of the pro meta stuff with Commander X, you probably realize that like one of the big counters for High Noon in this meta uh, at this level is, is Javelin, right? Like just Javelin, instant cancel, instant sign. So you need to get your, your big fat slab of meat uh, in front of the Cassidy. Um, and I guess it's obviously, that's kind of what happens here. But yeah, we get the split of the century. Ults used, they continue to pursue, they continue to chase. Now, Team Red there just needed to... Enjoy. I don't really understand Team Red's rotation. I think they were trying to bait the rotate, but Schmungus hits him on the rotation. And then once again, Alvocate's just like... Like... Okay, sorry. Hang on, guys. Hang on. We, we, we have to have something appropriate for this.
Why? Why? why there's just nothing happening. There's just nothing happening. Like nothing is happening. Um, so there's been a you know a bit of a miscommunication there in terms of the timing, and this has been obviously a consistent issue for Team Red. Right. And they're gonna chase SK. 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 Right. Well, there you go. Well, this is a dumpster fire. How does Hollywood happen is the question. How does Hollywood... Okay, we're definitely angle maxing here. Okay, we're getting some serious... <laughs> what? What is going on, man? What is going on? Okay, so we have like just a just it's just a 1v1 happening, totally isolated here, because I guess why not? And then there's another 3-2-1 hard push here. And really Team Red needs to be ready to pop ultimates here. Like Arisa ult, Kitsune. Like right now, you need to be popping ults. It's just too late. And 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 oh. Twilo? Twilo? Sir? Sir? Okay, there you go. <laughs> no way! No way, they don't touch, do they? Okay, phew, that would have been... <laughs> that would have been unfortunate. Okay, well... Uh, I mean, Schmungus' setup is... Setups have just been better. The execution has been better. There's been some serious timing issues from Team Red, and obviously they don't even get any of the ult setups. This has been what I would call... In a hive mind with angles, which is like a really good strategy, right? Where you you just end to end, but you have like that one flank. And because the pressure from main is so decisive and so high tempo, people don't check their angles, right? Like how many times, I mean, do we need to have a really hard push plus an off angle? And it works, right? It's been good. It's been good. Now, this is kind of interesting. So they're going to play Sigma Bap. There's a little bit more space for Sigma. And there's a little bit more space for BAP. But again, they're going to run this Echo. Is, is Boger just one-tricking Malga? Is, I guess he's just one trick Because this Echo Sojourn comp... Like, Echo is not good on this map, frankly. Uh, it's a lot, way too open space. Um, so this seems like, at least on the opener here, I like... Obviously, Malga is kind of like, whatever. Not that great. But the DPS and support lineup... For Team Blue is probably better with the wit with what's being rolled out right now. Because this we got some nice poke heroes. We got some off angle control here. Team Red's gonna need to get their Lucio and Echo seriously involved on the flanks here. In fact, the only thing I don't like for Team Blue is the uh the Malga. I think an Orisa or a Sigma would be better. Uh, I don't know. Like, this is the good one. This is the one I was told to ask about. I mean, yeah, this is exactly what happens. I mean, you just have like this, you have like this organism spreading around the map, like solo off angle, solo off angle, solo off angle. Um, frankly, there isn't really an easy solution here. I think probably what needs to happen is kind of like a three, two, one peak here, like a three, two, one speed sojourn slide force the duel here. Um, and just to force these off angles out. Because like, like the thing is, guys, is you cannot let them have these the, the number of angles that they have right here. It's too many. This is this is angle maxing done to an extreme. And the thing with angle maxing is angle maxing is like a boa constructor. The more time that you give that boa constructor to squeeze in that position, the less of a chance you have to break it. You have to just shatter it. You have to do it quickly. You have to do it early. Um, but yeah, there's, there's too much inactivity here. And so, yeah, it's just inevitable. And then we're just going to keep skipping until we actually have a fight here. Rang Reinhardt is good against angle maxing strats. He's pretty good because what do you think you could do with Reinhardt is you could be like, oh, your Iliari is over here. I'm going to pin on your Iliari. Forces shift, breaks pylon, forces Iliari. And it kind of, it kind of like um, it accordions the enemy team's angles, like squishes them together. So instead of having an angle here, an angle here, and an angle here, you would have all of these angles would kind of have to shoot scoot this way, right? So it'd just be like two angles instead of four, right? Uh, and, th and that's through the power of pin. Is Sigma do just stay point? It depends. It depends. Point is fine, but like, yeah. Shut up, Turlands. Again, angle maxing here. I actually don't even know what kills SK. Oh, spawn camp. 
Well, they the angle maxers got angle maxed. I actually did not even insert elevator music here. Oh my days. Okay, well there's that. There it is. That's a good start. Angle maxing. Angle maxing. Oh, look, the Lucio's on the move. Again, there's just like a timing with like the synchronicity of this. You know, like there needs to be like a, con there needs to be like a concerted, is that the word concerted? Concerted effort. Yeah, a concerted effort of Lucio Sojourn 3, 2, 1, slide this way. This widow is free low, especially with the echo pincer behind, but it's always like there's kind of some thought about it, but echo kind of goes early. And then Lucio's by himself, and Sojourn's just kind of like standing there. Like they're putting a lot of attention on Malga, which is fine. So even though they're down one here, like this fight feels way more winnable than it should have been. Um, I mean, this fight is still technically even winnable here. Like, I don't know about that side. That was kind of silly. Is that Sojourn Kai? Kai wishes that Sojourn was him. Angle maxing. Now, is this well-timed? Let's see this from Team Red here. Are we going to actually get it? I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Why is this not working? Okay, there we go. Kind of, kind of. They kite it out. They're going to send Idiarian Widow on the left flank. SK gets caught in the rotation, though. Now, this is Schmungus trolling. Schmungus troll. Because you guys want to know what would have kept SK alive here? Besides, you know, making the jump properly. A Widowmaker right here. Or at least punished, right? I mean, look at this, right? Look at even through this window. The problem is, is that they're doing kind of the same thing that Red was doing, where they're taking space before the team has actually set up their angles. And so there's 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 too there's too rushed. There's too much rushing. Now now it's good. Now it's good. Widow should always win that duel at that range, even with just SMG alone. And that's and they and they catch the dive there. That was really good. That was really well done. Yeah, it was really well done. Okay, set up again. Widow angle is a little tight. They need to be careful. They probably should rotate back to point with the ultimates that they have and just use BAP window back, either back right or back main. Have the Idiari Widow hold left side. Ah, gee, Wilkers. Ah, frick, man. We should have rotated out. I also don't know why ML7's position on this side either. Did he get caught in rotation? What's my guy doing? They, again, like they want to be fighting in the open space here. They should be taking these fights to point. Malga just lives. May off angle. Widow Iliari off angle or, you know, whatever. And then Bap can kind of play it here. Yeah. <clears throat> Boger's just going to go. I don't think he's going to win this. Oh, Bo Boger, sir. So he's just going to use his ult as literally just a shield. So he doesn't die. But yeah, I mean, that they, they beef their Widow. Their EDR is also not particularly well positioned. And even with the BAP window, I think it's really important that your EDR is able to position at least here because look at what ML7 could have done from here, right? Look at this. This Echo gets no value. She either dies to BAP winner or she dies to EDR. Blam, blink, blink, blam, 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 blam. Kill the Orisa, blam, blam, blam. Kill the, right? You, 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 have, you need to play your EDR like a turret. This stack here is the second. They, they're not angle maxing, guys. They stop angle maxing. GG's. I guess these guys suck now. Honestly, honestly, I can't even can't even imagine even considering working with these guys. Actually, trash cans. Kiriko is a good swap. If you don't need as much healing, you want to play for more angle maxing. It's good. Angle max. Angle max. Angle max. I like what almost seven's doing. I like our rotation around. It's good. There's no cover for Orisa. And again, you see Team Red is just completely paralyzed by inaction. Just basically four stacking back and not trying to put... Like, they needed to be pushing these guys out with some sort of Lucio Sojourn Echo proactivity. They didn't do it. It's just a matter of time. Just remember the, the Anaconda. Bit of a messy fight there. They do actually push now that they're down one, so things start to get messy. What, what is happening over here? Sir. Okay, so that just happened. Right. 
Nice shot. Can we continue to angle Max? Can we not conga line? Don't conga line. Don't conga line. Don't conga line. Don't do it. Thank you, Zergy. That's, you see what happens when you conga line? They conga lined. They conga lined. You needed to open this up. I think SKS being here is okay, but Quirksu has to rotate. Has to rotate. Has to use, even using grapple, like, wh wait, wait. What did we use grapple? Like, even not even using grapple. Rotate, fine. Run, run your little tootsies over here. You need to set up the pressure here. This is a conga line. One, two, three, four, all in a lane. It's no bueno. Will they still win though? Kablam! Kablam! Angle maxing, ML7's angle maxing! ML7's angle maxing! Win them all! Win them all! Win them all! Come on, SK! Nice, guys! Easy first map, probably. Easy first map. Okay, so uh, some angle maxing, some silly maxing for sure. I think there needs to be a better job of like setting up our angles before we're taking fights. And then ML7 and Quirksu, a couple, a couple of slaps upside the jaw. You get what I'm saying? It's good nature. It's tough love. Tough love. <clears throat> okay. Hollywood. Now... <laughs> What is this? This is a monstrous number. By the way, I can eat lunch, by the way. Yeah, yeah. Sorry. Thanks. <clears throat> um, so, huh? Oh, nice. Um, they're going to be playing a lot of angles here. Surely. Because I see this comp. Are they just playing for like a TP hook? What is Boger doing? Okay. They, okay. Blue is playing a real comp. What is this composition? Okay, let, 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 let's, let's dig a little deeper here. <clears throat> what is this composition strategy? Here's how it works. Malga, why are we on Ana? Okay, never mind. You know what? Never mind. Malga plays, can control main, apply tank pressure, whatever, look for opportunities to, uh, to do whatever. You can have your May or Widow playing solo off angles. ML7 can support one of those solo off angles. Why is my A key not working? Uh, and then Ana can either support main or take her own off angle. So it's kind of like a kind of sort of spammy comp, like lots of mid to long range characters. The problem with that is this first point, you're not gonna be able to get a lot of space. Oh, they thought they were already out. Makes sense. So like... The problem here is that like, there's not really a lot of space here. So like, let's just treat it seriously, right? Like let's pretend that they are qualifying for free. Like you, you, you don't really have a lot of good angles here, right? You're gonna get stuffed out pretty easily. So I don't know. We've got May walking forward without Boger. So then May's cooldowns are forced. Boger's hard flanking, which allows them to be pushed. Now, once again, though, you, you notice this is a big issue with Team uh, Blue, or I guess now, is their timing of the pushes are really bad. Like, they, they really tend to kind of go in one at a time. So what the Arista's is doing is not even bad, but it's going it, to get punished, almost certainly. What is ML7 doing? Is ML7 just tanking, like, five people? There's no way. What? What just happened on my screen? What on earth? How? What? How did... What? There's no way. ML7 just casually holds the angle there versus three people for like the duration of the Lord of the Rings extended trilogy. And they just went off of that. That and the, the poor timing with blue. Okay. Also, I really, we really have to roll this. I'm There's been a lot of those this review, I'm not going to lie. Um, 
I mean, I'm gonna, actually, you know what? I'm going to keep that window pulled up because I have a feeling that's going to be happening more often. It happened even more in the second round. Um, no, that's not the stream deck doing its job. I'm not that smart. What's happening over here? Okay, so yeah, some serious trollage going on here. I, I don't even know what's happening anymore. This is literally a ranked game. This is literally a ranked game. We're just staggering. We're going in one at a time. Okay, well, we're ranked gaming. Uh, please tell me quirks. Why are we? Okay, we're still on Widow. Okay, now, they're going to have Sojourn Ult. If we're even ult tracking, like, were we even ult tracking at this point in time? Like, do we even know? Like, is there any sort of strategy happening here at all? Like, the, the, the easiest solution here is probably just to, like, nano your Malga. No, no, here's what it is. Here's, here's the juice, okay? Use Cardiac to force Arisa cooldowns and then just can keep going with your nano Malga. And then that'll force something, right? And then it just creates enough space probably for Blizzard or whatever else. I mean, heck, you could even use your Cardiac and then use it on Blizzard uh, once Arisa doesn't have her CDs. So we'll see. Big thing here is I want to see if, do we have enough space? Oh, he just goes in. Oh, he just goes in. Okay. Right. So, unfortunately, Hoi Yonki, Ho Hoi Lucio doesn't realize that you can't boop Malga. Or, or maybe just reacts too slow, whatever. And, and then that they get smoked. Also, ML7 pops a little bit of Adderall. And there you go. I was about to pull his hair out trying to make this a productive review. I will win. I will win. I will not be defeated by this. We will learn something from this. Trust me. We will. Okay. Initial positioning here. Actually really quite good. We got Boger on high ground. I, I guess you can make that rollout. Can you make that rollout? Wait, what? I'm sorry, guys. Can you just imagine without context playing a first person shooter like Call of Duty back in 2009? This is a real thing in the legitimate first-person shooter genre. Okay, anyway. Um, I, I like the positioning here with the exception of like a couple of things here. Yeah, TF2, I guess. Yeah, Th this is, this is, okay, this is something else. I also would like ML7 to be holding up top here with Boger. So like ML7 here with Widow here, Malga here, Ana taking the back high ground, be able to pocket and control all angles. And then May on cart. The reason you have May on cart is because her poke value isn't really that good and somebody has to go to cart, right? So it might as well be May. <clears throat> They're talking about angles. Yeah, this is this is okay. I just don't like the angles that the Widow's taking. It's too isolated. It's too close. And then also using your grapple. And then ML7's kind of on the floor. So yeah, that, that's, that's a GG's. ML7's positioning has not been super good. They're going to try and pincer... They hit the Tracer. Honestly, not even the worst trade in the world. Could be worse. SK needs to drop down sooner. Yeah, they just get picked apart. Like, they actually were able to close the distance here, Team Blue, finally, for once. Uh, and then, obviously, the initial setup just wasn't as good as it could have been. Can we review their comms? I, I think even I have a limit. If all your angles are bad, then you mean, Broga, you have somebody in spawn. You have somebody in spawn. This is something I talk about with bronze players. I don't care if you haven't even qualified. Why, why do people do this? You're in spawn, you dense jackass. What is wrong with you? Good, die, die, die. Worthless. What is wrong with these people? He's not even there. The May's still not there. What is wrong with this guy? Is there something in the water in Bulgaria? Is it arsenic? Is there active brain rot before the age of like 12? Come on. Like, it's not even like, oh, it's, the, it's no, there's no strategy in this at all. Also nice angle maxing. Once again, conga line. Oh, and by the way, you know why they're conga lining? Because they're in such a rush to help this jackass. This guy's unhelpable, uncoachable. Absolutely useless, nice shot. Says the Florida man, bro. Okay, well, this is just now a stagger. We're all on the stagger maxing. Nice job. 
Does this even work? Oh, that sucks. Well, it was worth a shot. <laughs> it, was, it, was worth, it, was, it was worth a shot. Because <laughs> how many times in this review are we going to have, man, if they'd only stayed perfectly still and not moved, you'll be fine. How many times has that happened? Just don't move. Okay. Well, Boger's going out there again by himself. Shocker. How long will he live? Oh, no, he's going to run back. That's good. Good, 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 good. We're learning. I thought ML7 that he said he had a bad map. Boger's not even had a map. He spent more time doing nothing when he needed to be doing something and doing something than when he needed to be doing nothing. The epitome of everything wrong with the Overwatch scene. This is your ranked teammate, right? This is your ranked, this, this guy right here. This is your ranked teammate. Nice shot. Wait, we got to check it. Nice. Now, what I would like to see here is especially given the fact that the enemy team is all on the floor and the fact that they have bead and Kitsune and so on, I would like to see Mr. Boger go boom, 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 go up the thing here and angle max here. Get rid of these guys. Here. Okay. Then, depending on the enemy team's reaction, if they push, these guys just back up. Boger smokes them from behind. If they don't, then you can slowly start to kind of squeeze your man a deeper angle. Like you need to create, you need to open things up, right? You don't got Lucio. You don't have, you have all these sniper pokey characters. You need to kind of slowly create space sequentially, you know? That's too creative. Well, how is he creative in all the wrong ways? This isn't angle maxing. Like, look at these jackasses. Idiots. And they're on the floor. They've got, they've won a, they're on the floor. Oh man. Bro, where's this? I was promised angle maxing. This ends. Okay, so at least Boger takes the high ground now. Bam. Sojourn off. Beautiful. But yeah, I mean, at this point, I guess it's too late. Son of a gun, man. Let's also enjoy these mechanics. I was promised angle maxing. So he gets the crit. Tickles the toes. Tickles more toes. Eh, it could be worse. No, I didn't say that. Okay, nice. Now we're staggering still. We're still staggering. We're still staggering. Guys, this is more... This is unbelievable. Okay, well, Arissa now also over... Does Arissa just not realize that... Okay, I'm sorry. This is not real. This is not real. This is not real. <laughs> what is going on? What what game are we playing, guys? Like, what what game are we playing? Okay, well, this is this is a real uh, flower petal launches a Samoan. I I can't even do this, man. Okay, I guess we're on Life Weaver now. All right. <clears throat> And we're gonna, by the way, gonna keep staggering here. Unbelievable, really. Okay, so how is our setup looking? Better, I don't like Life Weaver on the car. I think Life Weaver probably needs to play back there, yeah. I think you could probably also, if you think that they're gonna touch, it's probably better to have your May off of card as well. Um, but yeah, I think this is at least a slightly better setup. The only problem here is ML7 needs to trust and stay high. I think ML7 thinks they're just going to cap. Yeah, and then now... Uy. Probably should just pop ult right here, honestly. If I'm ML7, yeah. Yeah, this is just... 
it's it's just not the best setup, you know? Like if if May was able to just like do her thing without having to worry about like like you could have life gripped your Malga instead of life gripping your May if your May had been properly positioned. I think they were too greedy for the touch. Being greedy for touch is super risky. ML7 does end up back on the flank though. So that's good. And SK will win this 1v1, trust. See? Never doubted. Nice. Nice. Now we should do an overwash versus schmuck. Maybe there's too much risk there. Maybe there's too much fear. Whatever team would you know would, would irreparably have uh, their reputation damaged. Arisa solo push, pull there. What is Boger doing? Boger is Boger angle maxing again. Oh my gosh. Why is he? What is this aim, guys? I'm sorry. The initial one was like fine, okay? This is fine. Bro, what is this? <laughs> okay, we need another. We need another one. Right, so they are really contesting this high ground here, which is generally pretty tough, but again, angle maxing, I guess. They're chilling, they're chilling, Boger's low, pulse, again another pull from SK, clutching it out. They punish the Orisa, and they're gonna push. Okay, now the question is, how are they going to break this choke? What what happens here? Did they just get angled? They got angle maxed on. Yeah, they got angle maxed. See, they, they, they got angle maxed on. You see what happens? You see what happens when you don't angle max? They got angle maxed on. So the quote unquote kings of angle maxing got angle maxed on. There's the Yari ult. There's no space for it. I don't even know what you're doing. You're popping it from main. It hits Kiriko, it gets cleansed, GG's. Widow gets a pick though. Well, they're not even angle maxing. He's not a top Malga player like Metro, that's true. All right, let, let, let's see what Widow player is gonna do here. I bet they didn't even know he went Widow in the first place. It doesn't count if it's not a Shmongus play. Look, what are they doing? What are they doing? They were standing still! Zoning Blizzard. Love it. What is angle maxing? Uh, okay, well then there's cap. Angle maxing is taking more off angles and when you think that you've controlled every off angle, you take another one. And then you keep taking off angles until there's no more off angles left. And then you recruit more friends and you take more off angles. Oh my days. What is happening, bro? Oh. What, a, what is this? What is this? Oh. What? What? What is this? There's no way the turrets got the kill. There's absolutely no way this happened.
This is the most degenerate thing I have ever seen in my life. And I've seen XQC's Twitch chat. What is this? What is that? That is disgusting. Oh my gosh. Any respect for this team is gone. There's four turrets on the battlefield right now. Four! There's four of them! Four! I guess that's the key to win. You just put it in the hands of something smarter than you. Un unreal. Nice angle maxing, by the way. Check this out. This is great. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We are angle maxing. Whoa, 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 whoa. We are angle maxing. We're angle maxing, guys. We're angle maxing. And uh, once again, Echo's by herself. Awesome. Bro, that would be fun to have like a five turret. Malgam I say fun. I I what is Boger doing? So Boger just needs to chill, but he decides to go in instead. And then Cardiacs when he's at like three HP. And by the way, once again, let's just enjoy these mechanics. This guy, this is a fortified Orisa. You couldn't miss if you try, and he still missed like a third of his bullets. You got angle max by two ads? Get rolled. If you aren't dumping every single penny in your life savings into my coffers, you are not only worthy to get uh, unworthy to watch my stream, you're unworthy, period. Again, really disappointing lack of angle maxing here. Uh, Mitch, uh, Mil Mit, Mit, Mount Chili Manjaro. Mount Chili Manjaro. That's good. Thank you for the sub. Sorry? No, sorry doesn't cut it. How does this happen? What happens here? Does, does, did we get railed? Why are we stacking the turrets all in one spot? Why are we stacking the turret? What, what, what is wrong? Why are we doing this? Why? Like, I, honestly, why? Good. That was disgusting. That was stupid. It's dark. <laughs> it's dark. <laughs> it's dark, guys. And yeah, this fight's lost. Well, wait. ML7's angle maxing. ML7 is angle maxing. Wait, where are we? Okay, okay, okay. Wait a second. 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 <laughs> Why, why did he use the cooldown? What did he even do? Okay, well, we're <laughs> needless to say that uh, that did not go well. I don't like that fade either, especially during mid cardiac. Uh, yeah, okay. Well, that, uh, that went uh, predictably poorly. No, why, why is this? No, no. No, 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 no. Okay, now, now I'm starting to see what you guys were talking about. No, 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 oh my gosh. Wait, they're winning. No, 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 no. I can't believe this, guys. I can't believe this. They just threw three ultimates into a lost fight. They're throwing more. They're going more. They're still going. You missed everybody. You, how do you miss everybody? It's a grandmother. She is 93 years old. Unreal. How do you miss grandma? How? This is unreal. Oh, good. Why not more? Sure. Why not? Let's go. Let's just keep going, Boger. Well done. Keep going. Keep going. Good, good, good. Let's die with that. That's good. Good. Excellent. I cannot believe this. And now MSL decides to toggle because why not? This is like watching toddler UFC.
Like just just like give them brass knuckles, take away the take away like the goldfish and just let them go ham. It's like it's incredibly disturbing and violent, and yet I can't peel my eyes away. What what okay, we're going in again. Again, by the way, angle maxing, by the way. Angle maxing. Angle maxing. There's more physical touch here than at high school prom. And, and by the way, angle maxing is really helping out Boger here. But in the Ana, by the way, the Ana. With all due respect to Mick G. Does it work? Yeah. Baby dropper, please. Please don't, please let me die in peace without having to live with that on my shoulders. So I'm assuming we're going to see some swaps here, right? Like, no, what am I, what am I saying? There's not going to be any swaps. Why not Torb? Seriously, why not Torb, guys? What, where's the Torb? Why don't I go full turret mode here? Zergi, Torb. Do it. No, dang it. Okay, how are they going to retake this space here? So they need to, they do have the advantage of like people are on cart. I don't know why Lucio's here. Purely ornamental. This guy seems a little lost, a little confused. So it's like a senior in a shopping mall. So maybe he's a little lost, but that does mean that we could actually take this space here. We could, we could, we could, we could pop out like Symmetra here with Iliari. Symmetra could throw TP up there with Iliari ultimate from the angle here. And then Boger could go slam, slam, ham, bam, you know, up here with Moira. We could retake the angle here. What's the plan with this poke comp? Great question. Hey, we did it. But we're, we're all by, we're poorly timing it. It's, 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 it's not well executed, but at least it's the right idea. What, what is Boger doing? Like, honestly, what is Boger doing? Go top, Boger. Go top. Like, the whole plan was to go top, right? What is he doing? He's, what is he doing? Go. What is he doing? What is happening? He just looks vaguely lost all the time. Like, actually, no, that's not even true. Not even vaguely lost. The vague is a vacant expression in his face, but he looks completely lost. I was promised angle maxing. I'm getting nothing. We, we need, okay, rhyme zone, rhyme zone. Here's, we need something, we need something better than angle because this is not happening. Bangle maxing, dangle, jangle, mangle, strangle maxing, no. Tangle, wangle, triangle. Hmm. Mangle maxing. Yeah, mangle maxing. Yeah, that, that, that's actually good. Mangle maxing, that's true. Mangling is like mashing something to bits, right? So like, it's like twisting it. Uh, so like, they're taking angle maxing, but they're twisting it. Mangle, 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 To destroy something by twisting it with force, yes. From its original form, right? Yeah, so we started out with angle maxing, but they've mangled angle, angle maxing. You get what I'm saying? Yes. I think that's probably the case that we have here. So this is a mess. Uh, this is a total, total, total mess. I don't need, again, I, I, I'd ask at this point, what is Boger doing? But at this point, I, I feel like that question is just, I, what, why are we even asking that question anymore? We don't know what Boger's doing. Boger doesn't know what Boger's doing. Oh, he's diving backline. Okay, well, there we go. We're back on Widowmaker, goodness knows why. We're literally just total chaos. You see, when we're actually ma angle maxing, you see, like, when we're actually angle maxing here, right? Look at the reds. Stuff happens even in the chaos, right? It's when we're all like conga lined. You know what I'm saying? There's a call to flip the map here. Really? There was a call to flip the map here. This is flipping the map? Once again, the toddler analogy just is so resonant with me. You guys ever seen toddlers do like gymnastics before? I don't know what it is with like, you know, Caucasian mothers and their obsession with making their young, like two-year-old doing gymnastics, but they, they put them in their little 
suit, leotard, and, and they just like flop them around and roll around. And it's, the, it's, it's kind of cute, but it's also kind of pathetic and a little weird, right? This is kind of what we're having here, right? This is, this, is, this, is, this, is, this is flipping the map here. Boger goes in by himself. Goodness knows why. I don't even know where other people are. I think we still, oh yeah, oh, by the way, we still have a Widowmaker in spawn because, you know, why not here? Holding the angle of something. Kiriko is here. Moira, I guess Moira is in a position to do something. The call, this is not ranked gameplay. This is just, this is just rank. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Oh boy, this is... Also love the fact that Zergi just like looks death straight in the eye. Oh, no. Wait, what HP was that released? I gotta know. Like that was close. First off, why, why is she charging it? Okay, yeah, there it is. Dude, there's no way. There's no way. Seven? Two? Dude, she pulled it at two. She pulled it at two HP. Two. One, two. Two. Two HP. That's actually unbelievable. I've never seen that before in my life. What is going on? What is happening? What? 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 Why? Why? What's the plan? <laughs> Why? What? What was the plan? All right, well, this ought to be good. I'm ready for this one. I don't, have we frozen a single person yet? Like, I understand Arista Fortify and at the comp, but honest question, have we, even with the grandma on the loose, have we frozen anybody? Like, this entire match? I don't think we even froze anybody in the first map, did we? No, don't give me that idea. Were they having fun? I'm not having fun. Nobody's having fun. Oh, that's a great wall right there. That's 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 beautiful. I don't know what we're cutting off there. It, I, I don't even. You, you, you could do a wall randomly anywhere on the map. That probably would have provided more than that. So we're off to a great start. Spilo mechanics. And if only there was a, something we could push with here. There is just no way. What are you doing? What are you doing? Why? Like, to call that zoning is a compliment. Oh my days. This has to be some of the worst May play I have seen ever. Ever. Lock the guy up, please. Okay, once again, shocker, Boger's going in. Now, we do have a widow angle here. So that works. But let's see what let's see what the the Bogue does. Come on, Bogue. Boger. Love it. I love this. I love this hero so much. I inspire so much joy. Right. I, I, I don't I don't know what's to learn from that. There's nothing. It's awful. It's just terrible. I'm honestly a little disappointed in myself looking at that POV. Toggle. Yeah, I got, I got a great idea, guys. I have a great idea. Here's an idea. Here's an idea. Let's not... Okay, so while there... Let's not... 
Let's not stand in front of the, the Arisa. What, what do you guys think? What do you guys think? Maybe when they have like, you know, Kitsune and beat, like, let's try something else. Let's try a different side. Do you guys want to try that? Maybe that's an option here. Maybe that's an option. Oh, that's right, the trackball. Okay, well, surely, guys, surely we will get one frozen target, guys. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. Poll time, poll time, poll. Now, so if you guys have seen this, I'm trusting you not to vote. One freeze, no freeze, vote. Go ahead. I'm voting. Can I vote? Yes, I can vote. I'm voting, no freeze. Oh my days, that looks delicious. Thank you. <clears throat> so does the food. <laughs> uh, <laughs> <clears throat> All right, guys. <clears throat> it's close. It's close. It's a close vote. <clears throat> I'm I'm voting on zoning old here. I have zero faith. Thirty-five to thirty-nine, thirty-seven to thirty-nine. Come on, thirty-seven to forty. All right, listen, listen. You guys said he's gonna or they were gonna freeze somebody, right? Right. Z that's a zero freeze, cactus puppy. Zero freeze. In fact, that's worse than zero freeze. You guys are fools. You guys are fools. There's not going to be any freeze. Fools. No, Mike, get down. Nah, 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 nah. Accidental, accidental. Doesn't count. Like, it is hard to play May into this, let's be very clear. But obviously, Verbal abuse is not ever something that we're ever going to let up on. So yeah, total absolute cataclysmic disaster as I spew a giant chunk of rice into my keyboard. Awesome. It was accidental. The echo was behind the May. They didn't know she was there. You, you didn't. You were wrong. You won the poll, but you were wrong. And they didn't freeze anybody. Sorry. Hello? Is that me? Hello? I, I didn't even know. I just by accident. What? Hello? Ready to throw in the towel? 30 seconds. Yeah. Ain't much time left. Throw them over. Objective A.
High ground? Sorry. Where is SK? Oh. Where is SK? Am I missing something? Who do I main? Great question. Chat, who do I main? Who do I main? <clears throat> so yeah, shockingly, they lose this fight. I, I don't know how it happened. Okay. I um, I'm shocked. At this point, you'd think I wouldn't be. Bro, wait, wait. What is this comp? Yeah, we saw Yidl's new tank video already. It's good. W hello, angle maxing. Well, uh, right. Boger going in by himself. SK is totally AFK. SK is now out of position. What What is Quirksu doing? You can't go in that deep of a flank versus a Lucio comp that close. Unfortunate pull again, wall out, Sojourn angle to OP, no angle maxing again. Why is it every angle that we max is like some absolute wacko out the wazoo and then we don't do anything. There's no in between. It's like total insanity or like, it's like, yeah, what, what do you, what, what kind of movie? I, well, I, I'm, 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 I let my kids watch, you know, Teletubbies and Silence of the Lambs. Like, the, like <clears throat> it's so bad. It's, again, right, it's mangle maxing. Mangle maxing. <clears throat> Silence of the Tubbies. <laughs> <laughs> Silence of the Tubbies. Mmm. <laughs> Um, so obviously they win this, but this should be pretty tough to win. Because ult-wise, Blue's got better ults. Like, Tree's fine, but like, Arisa ult, their first Arisa ult, they have Katuna for Katuna, they're gonna have Sojourn ult. Like, the High Noon maybe gets a pick? That's probably what I would guess. I'd say, I'd say High Noon gets a pick. I love Quirksu's or Quiraxu or whatever's. Like, like, I don't even know what the purpose of using this like, what's the point? Like, why even use it? Like, you might as well use it for later on. You might get a combo or something, right? It's just, like, even now, like, would be kind of annoying, right? Like, the hinder. Like, it's so weird. You're just like, whee! It's like throwing a party streamer. Okay. Kitsune for Kitsune. 
Oh, that's a, not a good layering. So Katsune, Katsune, plus tree. Tree is really bad. Should have saved the tree. High noon is sped, but then is doesn't really do much of. Oh, there it is. That's what we were waiting for. So it had to be high noon. Did they body block the javelin? Bro, there's two freaking javelins for this. Javelin, sir. Javelin. Javelin the Cassidy! Javelin! Javelin! We had two Orises! Javelin! He missed it! Oh! Oh! They're busy shooting the tree! He dies because he's shooting a tree! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! This is not real, man. This isn't real. There's no. This, we have a Kiriko basically throwing paper clips at a block of granite. Eventually it'll break, guys. Oh my gosh. I knew it, but I didn't. I thought it was gonna be like some like life grip pole play or something creative, but no, it, it's just brain rot. Will the blizzard freeze anybody? It has to, right? Yes, we get a freeze. We did it, guys. We got lots of freezes. We have multiple freezes. One, two, three. How do they get froze or frozen? He sits on, he sits on heels. He doesn't wall ride. Oh, my days. Okay. Right, so regardless, we get three whole freezes. And then Boger C9s with the javelin spin. More like plot armors. More like plat armor, bro. That what on earth? That was terrible. That was awful. You guys ever seen Bird Dimmick? No, link the comms, SK. You guys ever, you guys ever seen Bird Demic? This is Bird Demic. <laughs> my my ball's bouncing. Okay, we're gonna skip. <sighs> suck Max. I suck Max. We're good. Angling Reese or someone. Big freeze! Big freeze! Freeze Max! Freeze Max! Oh, hope our Kiri. I need some, I need I some back 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 I'm help maxing you. I'm back. help maxing you. Support maxing. We're so low. We're so low. Bro, I can, I can mog them. You should mog them. You should mog them. I'm mog maxing, bro. Nice. Nice. Oh. 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 It's fine. Oh. 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 I almost have my ult. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Orisa, 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 Orisa. Why are they saying that? What does that mean? Why? Do, well, thank you. Why? Why are they saying that? What does that mean? Orisa, Orisa, so good. So darn, so so dream. So dream. Booger, this is this is Malga Max. Well, I can, bro. This is It's fine. We max We uh, max on point, then we win. I go smash him. Oh, nice. Wow, wow. It's fine. It's fine. We max. We max. Orisa, 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 Orisa,
Spawn Max! I'm so Echo, 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 Oh, Arisa, survival, Arisa, surviving. Arisa, 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 Everyone Arisa. living. Oh. Echo, echo low. Echo one. Echo Winnable. One. Engaged. I must have rush. Let the Walker, come to me. I'm done now. I have wood if you can convince this. It's fine. This is an angle to angle max even harder. It's awesome time. Mm -hmm. Sleep angle. Wait. Oh. No. Alright, I'm going on my creative oh, angle. Angle, 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 Lucio, Lucio. Why did no one tell me to aim with Max before? I'm going on a creative it's angle. It's so simple. Yeah. I won't expect this one. No, 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 I'm point maxing right now, I'm point maxing. Oh, I, I don't trust this guy, I need a point. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> too soon, too soon. Honestly, I might just walk Max out of the point. Although Lucio's afraid. Oh, uh, echo no fly. I'm low Walk back, Max. Walk back, Max. Oh, she had a creative point. angle on me. I'll be back very soon. Just survive. Survive <laughs> angle. It's fine, it's fine. Survive, Max. Survive, survive Max. Max. Oh, my bad. I can fox Max soon. I'm Lucio maxing. I'm dead, bro. I'm I'll be point maxing soon. I'm point maxing right now. This okay. Okay, they got excited. Wait, they might counter pick us, guys. We need to be careful. Huh? What, what they They're gonna be so confused, bro. <laughs> I'm yeah, kidding, I'm kidding. I'm Echo. Right now. Oh, they're on right side, right? Alright, so I'm coming, I'm coming. 3-1, 3-1, 3-1. Echo, 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 Push Max, push Max, push Max. Push Max, right side. I'm out, I'm out. Oh, we need another angle. Angle left, angle left. Lucio's main angling. Arisa's no gold. Arisa's no gold. Oh, what trial? I must have a maxing. Okay, let's go. I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Oh, hot max, hot max. Arisa, 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 I almost have tree, I'm tree maxing, give ticks, give ticks, I'm tree maxing. Evan and 20, get out, get out, 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 I'll play point, I'll play point, I'll play point. I'll, I'll, I'll platform you, right here. I noon three. I fell. I have no platform. Let them, let them, let them pass, let them pass. Pass max, pass max. Okay, I'm waiting on a bit fast back. Okay, now we have I'm waiting, we'll take, we'll take that. Can we lift this up? I need that ulti max. It's fine. Oh, kill Max, 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 Are we Are we Oh my god! <laughs> wow, unbelievable. Unbelievable, actually. They got out angled. Actually, crazy. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Nice, nice angle.
You guys ever heard of fetal alcohol syndrome? Let's talk about it. <clears throat> Basically, it's where you want to avoid certain things like alcohol, smoking, pollutants <clears throat> when you're pregnant, just because some of those things can be damaging to the well being of the child. <clears throat> just something to be aware of. <clears throat> <clears throat> 